this might very well be either the biggest waste of money or the most pleasantly unexpected needed device that I own. Let me show you what I mean. Hey everybody, welcome back. I got another cool device that I wanna show y'all. And you're probably wondering, how many more cool devices can I really get that are actually cool? Well, this one might not be on your list of cool devices to get, but I wanted to try it out. That way I could share it with you guys and make your own informed decision. But let's go ahead and open it up. Yep, it's a clock. But it's not just any clock. This is the Echo Wall Clock. Why is there such a thing as an Echo Wall Clock, right? And how does an analog clock work with Alexa? Well, we're about to find out. So it's, uh, at first glance, it's just an analog clock. It says Echo Companion to see timers at a glance. Works with Alexa. What's included? The wall clock, very important. Four AA batteries, a drywall screw, and a drywall anchor. So this is very simple installation. So you don't need to go buy anything. You don't need any special tools. I'm guessing it's a Phillips screw, so you'll need that screwdriver. And compatible with Amazon Echo, Echo Dot, Echo Input, Echo Plus, Echo Show, Echo Spot. So it's pretty much compatible with all Echo devices. Let's open it up. So like every other Amazon device, it's got this clear see-through pull tab. And then it's pretty easy just to open it up. Okay, nothing else in the box. Echo wall clock, echo companion to see timers at a glance. So it says, don't touch the hand. All right, won't touch the hand. And we got a quick start guide. So this says, caution, don't touch the hand. What's in the box, we already read that. And battery installation, set up your clock. There's a button I got a hold. And then it even gives me wall mounting instructions. So if I wanna drill into the hole, push the drywall mount into the dry hole, screw on the drywall screw and then hang the clock. Cool. And then it gives us some troubleshooting. So if it's pulsing orange, it's in pairing mode. If it's solid blue, it's paired. If it's pulsing blue, it's time syncing or updating software. It's even got software updates apparently. Pulsing yellow is a notification. Single blink red means battery is low and three blinks red means an error occurred. Okay. Maintaining your Echo Wall Clock. Don't drop it, don't throw it. Disassemble, crush, bend, puncture, or paint the Echo Wall Clock. If it gets wet, use rubber gloves to remove the batteries and wait for it to dry completely before installing new batteries. Don't attempt to dry your Echo Wall Clock with an external heat source such as a microwave oven or a hair dryer. Clean your Echo Wall Clock with a soft, cloth and avoid using liquids or harsh chemicals that may damage the wall clock. Be careful not to wipe your echo wall clock with anything abrasive. And then of course all the safety stuff. So basically it's a clock. Use it as a clock. Don't touch it. Don't do anything other than non-abrasive cleaning and hang it on the wall. So it says pull to open. All right. I don't know if that's the way it meant to open. That makes no sense. It says pull to open, but it opens from here. So we got the clock, it's got a lip on there. It's got all of these, I guess 60. And of course the mounting hook and the place for the batteries and the pairing button. Let's go ahead and throw the batteries in, comes with Everything in this 4A battery, drywall screw, drywall anchor, drywall anchor, drywall screw, four batteries. I'm guessing these are going to be Amazon Basics batteries because they always are. And then we've got the anchor and the screw. Mm, yep, Amazon Basics batteries. And Amazon Basics batteries are actually pretty decent. I don't think I've had an issue where like, you buy off-brand batteries and they don't work. I'm guessing that this was like a, yeah, it was a pull tab. Yep. So don't try to muscle your way into these batteries. There's actually a pull tab. So right at the top and at the bottom. 
Cool. So I've got four Amazon Basics batteries. Same batteries that they sell. These are 1.5 volt Amazon Basics batteries. So let's put those in the clock. Any lights? Nope. <laughs> A little bit of dust, that's about it. All right. Let's go ahead and put the battery cover back on. And I believe the very simple instruction just said, hold down the green button. I guess that's why you should read the quick start guide. Nope, it just says to mount it nearby and then tell it to mount. All right, I pushed the button. Alexa, set up my Echo wall clock. Let's do it for my iPad. So we're going to add a device, Echo. There's no option for a wall clock. That's interesting. Let's see how long I can hold this button down and see if it makes any blinking lights. Oh, there we go. So it's flashing orange. I don't know if you can see that. So I'm probably gonna have to yell at my Echo that's in another room. So add device, Amazon Echo. So it looks like you're gonna to have to follow the instructions to a T. Luckily I have Echo devices everywhere. Hmm. All right. So it says it'll take up to a minute to pair and then it'll turn blue once it's paired. Alexa, set up my wall clock. Look at that. That's amazing. I literally have a wall clock that is analog and it's setting itself. I'm wondering if I'm out of range now because I closed the door. But yeah, so that. That time actually changes on its own. And then for daylight savings time, it'll set itself, which is amazing. Oh, there it goes. So it's 327. I guess it's going to loop around. And it's not me, there's my hands. This is really cool. Doesn't sound like it's doing anything other than setting the time. Almost there. A wall clock. That's Bluetooth and sets the time for you. That's amazing. It's still flashing, so I guess it's not done yet. It's kind of adjusting a little by little. Ooh. That's it. So let me try something. Alexa, set a timer for five minutes. Five minutes, starting now. By the way, you can ask 
see how much time is left at any time. I'm sure if you could see it, but we got five minutes on this timer now. Well, four minutes now. That is really cool. There we go. So you can see timers, not just the clock. Alexa, cancel the timer. Five minutes, timer canceled. So there you have it. You'll get to see the timer up on the wall clock. Automatically sets your daylight savings. And it's a wall clock. And it's kind of nice. I don't know what else to say. It's a wall clock. So thanks for checking it out. See y'all next time.